The Electronic Sports League recently announced an anti-doping policy that includes a ban on competitive gamers using cannabis. One of the largest esports organizations, ESL, are partnering with Germany's National Anti-Doping Agency and the world's anti-doping agency to crack down on pro gamers who use drugs to improve performance. Traditional sports leagues have long struggled with how to handle players using drugs to increase their prowess. Evidently, this is no different in the world of esports. According to Alex Walker, tournament director of the Australian World Cyber Games, he knows of many pro gamers who use cannabis to play better. An entire team of competitive gamers even admitted to using Adderall, an ADHD medication, to increase concentration. To prevent this, the ESL is now prohibiting competitors from using a slew of different substances, including anabolic steroids, growth hormones, and cannabis. Gamers will now be drug tested randomly throughout tournaments, and penalties range from reduced points and wins to a competition ban of up to two years. Thankfully for the players, they can still use cannabis before or after games, just not during, as THC can be present in their bloodstream. So programmers can show up high, but aren't allowed to sneak a puff between games. While the ESL already had anti-drug rules, they were vague and unenforced. The organization hopes that its partnership with anti-drug groups who supervise traditional sports will stop gamers from using drugs to improve their chances at tournaments.